welcome to my youtube channel so today i'll show you how to dual boot kali linux and windows 10 so let's start guys so you have to install windows 10 in your operating system so i already installed and here you can see guys i already insert the dvd of kali linux in my dvd writer so this is the way so first of all we have to install a software which is make the partition so we can easily install the kali linux so this is the software mini tool partition tool so I give the link in description where you can download the software so first of all download the software and install it mini tool partition this is the software so first of all launch the application and here guys you can see the my C drive so we have to resize the partition so follow my step and you can easily make the partition so i'll make 50 gb partition where we can install kali linux so simply create the partition and then click on apply so it is restart the partition not completed in normal window so it will make the partition in boot time so you can see it is creating the partition and now it is coming back so we can check our partition is done or not so I am going to the computer management and here I go disk management so here guys you can see our C drive is 69 GB and oh, we have unlocated space 50 GB so now restart the windows 10 and now open the boot utility and first booting device is cd room so our kali linux is boot up and now select your language click on continue now you have to select your country so my country is india so i'll choose india and you have to choose your keyboard layout and here loader is installing the components so you have to enter your host name so i simply use kali you have domain you can enter the domain otherwise skip enter the password now we have to create partition so here guys you can see use the largest free space so we have a free space which is unlocated space so simply choose this partition and then click on continue so here guys you can create the partition if you want but right now we will not use the partition here you can see the free space 53 GB so simply click on continue so it will create the partition by itself now click on yes and then click on continue so it is creating the partition and now it is installing the files Kali Rix files all the files in our hard disk now you have to choose the network if you are using mirror network then click on yes otherwise click on no so I choose no and then click on continue now finally we have to install the grub so click on yes and then click on continue select the partition and then click on continue so where you can easily 
choose the operating system so grub is most important part click on continue and reboot the kali linux so now change your booting device so i back to my hard disk cd rom is first device but now i choose my hard disk is first booting device now click on f10 and exit so guys you can see kali linux and here both operating system is showing i choose windows 10 so my windows 10 is booting up you can see my window 10 is booting up here you can see my partition i open my computer and here you can see the windows partition one partition and now i restart the windows 10 and now i boot up kali linux so simply restart the operating system so i restart the operating system now we have followed the same step in bootloader we have to choose kali linux so here guys you can choose windows 10 or kali linux so i use kali so now our kali linux is booting up so here guys you can see our kali is booting up enter the username and password and here guys you can see our kali linux is successfully installed so this is the way how you can dual boot kali linux with windows step by step you can follow the all steps and you can install the dual boot so thank you for watching this video thank you very much